What's going down, Commanders? Hope everyone's doing well today. Um, I just want to give my first impressions, and I know I didn't do a voiceover yesterday. I weren't feeling it. A little bit under the weather yesterday, but I feel better today. Um, just my first thoughts and, or my opinion, my process of uh, this new unit, the Albert Ross or the Albatross, as I like to call it. Um, I'm enjoying it. I think it's a lot of fun. We didn't. I think I shit on it on the live stream when not the not the event live stream, but the actual update live stream. I think we we all shit on it pretty much from the um, from the get go, and we didn't give it a consideration that we've got the Proteus, and I think the Scream is going to be back in our base being used because of this unit and the War. I think they're called War Hogs. But if you was to get this unit, guys, and, and you'd say you couldn't get it all the way to level 10 and you couldn't get all the techs for it, my advice would be get the unit, get the gold tech, and then try to get as many levels on it as you can before you... I wouldn't worry too much about the silver and bronze tech. They're, they're an improvement on the unit, but if you are stuck for time or you just haven't got the units to do the bases, blah, 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 it's, you want to grab the unit, grab the gold tech. The gold tech is what makes this unit... Uh, with the, it's got the three missiles that, that spread out. That's where the big splash comes from. And it's about time kicks I put a, a, a unit in the game that had the, the splash that this has got. I'm sure they'll find a way to nerf it somehow and try to tell us this is not how it's supposed to be, blah, blah, blah. But that's kick size project, pro prerogative, should I say. Um, until then, they need to get on with it. Um, but yeah, I would, personally, I would go for the unit. Gold tech. Then get as many levels as, as you can on it. You've got, how long we got left? Nine hours, 35 minutes. I don't know what your time zone is, so I don't know how long you've got left before you have to go to work, before you have to go to bed. But try to get get the unit, gold tech, then put, throw as many levels on it as you can. It's a very good unit. Obviously, at level 10, it's got uh, 19 million health. I don't know what that goes up to. I will have to check the patch notes. But the, the unit itself is, is a lot of fun. And I think with the... Warhogs and the Pro uh, Proteus. This is where this is where the things are going to go south again for Kixai, because they've put this unit out and it's going to be the script kids are going to be all over this. The ones where they're using the script to deploy, retreat, deploy all the units, push the R key or whatever it is, the E key on the Jericho. This is where this is going to come back into play, and everyone's bases are going to get smashed. But I believe we, we will be able to use it just like that. But we're just not going to be as quick as the script, script kiddies. But unless Kixai try to try to put that right, which I doubt they will, we're going to get hammered, I'm afraid. It's just part and parcel of the game. Um, I don't know what else I want to say about this unit. I think it's, it's Survivors again. I'm a big Survivors fanboy. It's just a good unit. It's just fun. It's just a lot of fun to be messing about with. And that's what we want from the the game I'll, I'll say the previous unit we got the previous hero we got and the base unit was dull as fuck the, with the sagittarius i'm not i'm not saying it's the, the worst unit in the game what i'm saying is it's just it didn't feel like a hero in my opinion the range was too low yeah there was no splash with it you know it didn't and and everything about the unit just didn't make sense i like the fact that it kills buildings as you as you drive around it but is it going to be uh, used in the game for much longer? I don't think it will. And I know a lot of Corpus fanboys will be going, oh, but I like it. It's Corpus. That's because you're fucking biased, bro. If you're 100% honest, the Centaur and the Sagittarius don't live up to the what we had previous to them, the uh, Oxford and, and um, Cannons and the Gus and... I forget what they're called. I forget what they're called. Cosmonauters. Anyway, uh, yeah, I hope this is a sign for things to come. I hope the other two, because we they, they absolutely shit on us. Pr the previous free air, the Series 2 free air, were crap. Were absolute garbage. There was one unit that was probably any good, which was the Dedulous that had a bit of use in the game. But if you, if you look at it as a whole, they were very poor units. Poorly constructed, poorly put together, no fault process put into them. Now they've made them fun. And uh, well, this first one's fun at least. And I'd like to see one that's a heavy armored uh, air unit that takes a lot of shots to kill, but maybe possibly slow moving. That'd probably be Sentinels. And then they will probably shit on the Corpus one again, to be fair, because Corpus have had a rough run of it just of late. 
I can't think of any units that I've liked, I've enjoyed out of Corpus. Survivors, Sentinels, I think the units are good. They're, they're a bit of fun. Or they do the job, on the, and they stay on the tin. Whereas Corpus have just been... Well, except for maybe the Prometheus, but that's yet to be seen. I've, I'm still getting levels on that. Whether that's going to be any use further down the line. But yeah, I like this. I, I, I truly believe it's going to be a spam unit. So get it, guys. Get the gold tech, as I say. And the next main event, which comes Thursday, you'll be able to pick up any missing parts that you've got for it. Um, any missing tech. I don't think you can get the build logistics. So get the build logistics today. Or if not, you've got, I think it's a six-day build now. They used to be four-day something or five-day something. Kicks I have up that. And instead of being 36 coins to coin after you've used the logistics, there's 60 or 70 coins, something stupid like that. But that's just kicks are getting greedy and they're shitting their pants about the stock market that they're tanking big time uh, still front. So that's part of what uh, we're having to deal with right now with, with the uh, way kicks I throw the offers at us, throw the units at us before they're, they're even in, in the game that's, uh, many times. And it's just... It's because still front of tank him massively, but yeah, other than that, I'm 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 happy camp off. I think there's there's improvements to be made with the game. Before I go any further, this is me ranting, by the way, guys. This isn't just me talking about this this unit. The game has been running like shit for fucking days, if not weeks. I think it got worse after that last maintenance of Thursday. The actual loading into the game takes forever. My units on the map were jumping all over the fucking place. I think that was Saturday or yesterday. Um, the, the map's lagging. It, when, you, when you're moving your units, it's like it's like they're jumping. It's like you click a spot and it, it sort of not... It doesn't turn around straight away. It's The game's fucking awful at the minute. And I, I don't know how, what, how they've done that. The only thing I think that may have broke it is the Gravedigger. I think the Gravedigger may have broken the game and there's a memory leak there somewhere with that unit because it's just been rough and it ain't just me i've been watching the, the pages and everything else in my discord and a lot of people are saying the same thing the game is just running like shit i'm, I'm guaranteed kicks i was going to say it's our computer our internet connection you know do a trace route blah 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 but nah it can't it can't be a, a thousand people's fucking computers and not, not kick size end you know it's just a shame and pvp's been horrible I don't, I don't get me wrong, I've managed to do the bases, but when, when you can't, when it doesn't feel like your units are moving as you're clicking and, and it takes a second or it takes a milli, couple of milliseconds to, for them to turn and move into the spot where you want them, it kind of takes away that feeling of accomplish, accomplishment. It, it makes you feel like you're not, it's not working as intended, should I say. And that's, again, down to kick's eye, okay. the way they uh, implement their shit in the game. Something's broken, I can promise you that, it's not our end. Something's broken at kick's eye's end and there's got there, there's a memory leak or there's a bit of bad coding that's breaking everything else in the game. It's something they've got to look at and hopefully they will by the time next maintenance comes down around, which will be, I don't even think it's this week, it's next week, maintenance will be around and that'll be when we see the new legendary unit for the set to break. It's fucking horrible to feel, think we went from three events a, week, a month with a war path. So one of them was a PvP event. To this month, we've got five events. Two skirmishes, main event, hold out, sector breach, you know. And then on top of that, we've also got the new Shadow Ops unit being put into... It, there's too much... What they're doing is to cram... And I, I believe this is true. They haven't given... They ain't given themselves enough time to cram all this shit into the game and check that it's all running as intended. And that's why we're getting a lot of breaks, a lot of fucking problems with the... The way the game runs. I've also done a, a complete clean up with my PC and everything else I could do. And it's still running like shit. And it's it's hard. But if you watch my videos, the pre the event video videos for skirmish, you'll see my units are jumping, they're sort of not, not not turning when I click. It's just shit at the minute, and it's Saint Kicks I've got to fix. Anyway, I'm gonna keep you much longer because I could rant on for hours, but I'm not gonna um Keep an eye out, I've got a Sagittarius video going to upload at some point today, I don't know when, it might be before this video or after this video, I'm not sure, but yeah, that'll be uploaded and then I'm, um, yeah, I'm not too happy with that unit guys, even at 20, I would, I would say that's the, the last hero you want to bother with, but other than that guys, stay safe and I'll see you soon, bye bye.